we saw we saw uh, legit vocals talk about upgrading early. He's gonna try again to do that right here. I believe he got at least one upgrade there. And having that early, as he said, is very, very strong as we see him rotate around someone else again. Coming up behind them. Oh. Oh, he's swapping, swapping spells. Okay. I thought he maybe DC'd there for a second. Um, as he's chasing around or going over to his chocobo, we're gonna swap over to Cran Carry. So we see Cran with one kill as well. Both competitors are pretty close together this time. So if there is a team fight that breaks out, we su could see some interaction like we kind of saw in that first game where uh, Legit tried to steal a kill from Cosmo. Very good stuff. Still one kill to one kill. This is a very slow start compared to some of the other matches we've had so far. But Legit sees a bio go off right below him. So he's going to try to get an angle on these, this fight going on right below him. You see him take a few shots. Hit the... Hit the Hits it for 20 so far. Let's see. He's going to hop on his chocobo and try to get down closer. Let's go. He's rotating around. Drops down right on top of him. He's going to put down the lightning as soon as he goes down. No, goes for the dash, but he doesn't get the dash to begin with. Uses his rush to go forward. Gets a few more swings. He's get hit fire taken back at him as he beats up on the chocobo and gets a down. Cures himself. Finishes him off for the kill. Let's see where the teammates are in this situation. Doesn't look like there's any teammates in the close range as we see legit go up two games to one. I or two fights. To... <laughs> I said you're down. You're down one zero now in this uh, final matchup. This could possibly be the final game of the tournament. How do you feel? And are you going to change up your strategy at all, or is it still just push? Uh, I'm really just looking for people. I haven't found anybody except for this person who is right on the screen right now. So hold on a second. Receive the Smith's bird as he takes a fireball to the face after a few hip fires, but he gave back up and finish off with the hip fires before the opponent can reposition and get some shots back in his direction. See him pick up kill number two. Again, this seems to be a very slow scoring game compared to the last couple of matchups. We'll see. So I see you ran off into the uh, the gas there a little bit. Was there some strategy there that I missed? Uh, there was two teams fighting out there, and I was trying to get them both. Uh, I was trying to get the kill on the one guy that was weak, but the Storm took it. And then the second guy, I comboed, and then Storm took that one, so I couldn't even get that one. So I, I left that with one kill, and a little sad, but that's what happens. Well, it, it was worth the effort, at least. Yeah. You got, got one kill. Um, I believe you are up three to two at the moment. Trying, but finding anybody is really weird this game. And now that my chocolate is dead, uh, won't have it for the rest of the game. So mobility is the problem now. Now this I we've been saying this could be the the last match of the tournament. Um, how do you feel? Are, are nerves building up? Are you anxious at all? Or is this like natural for you? I'm gonna tear you no, like anybody who's like watched me, like I, I solo spy in something I do and I just like to be consistent. Like I'm not trying to push for kills. I'm just pushing the teams because I want to get the advantages that I know I have. So it's, it's less a strategy of let's go and get all the kills and more of a strategy of if I am consistently at my best, then I am going to win this. Yes. All right. That is a very good strategy. Thank you for your insight and good luck. Let's ride. All right. We see. Oh, as you see the chocobo run and jump over him. Oh, it was Cran. <laughs> I got excited. Cran guy jumped over him. Oh, but we do see legit land down on somebody. Puts down some warrior swings as the ninja tries to do what he can, but he cannot fight back as legit backs up and goes back in with another dash. The ninja is going to try to rotate, puts down a bio, doesn't quite hit as legit dashes in one more time. He did get hit by the bio, so his health is going down. If there's another teammate nearby, he could be in trouble. Without his chocobo, he has to do what he can just to stay out of sight while he heals up. That was a very clean fight. We see Cran Carry getting fought in the background. Let's see if we can switch over and get a better point of view. We saw some fireballs and some thunder go down. 
We see Cram back back up again. Throws down a fireball. Doesn't quite hit. Jumps over the double fireball. Shoots down into it. Legit goes down in the background as Cram tries to hog up with a couple more kills. A gravity goes down. He's trying to keep his distance and get the shots in, but he's not quite landing them as he has three kills so far. Hits one, hits two, hits three, hits four, but he has fireballs coming down him. Stays consistent with those shots, gets the down. Very good shots there from Cran. He's going to get the finish for the fourth kill. Now, we did see Legit go down in that last fight as he was pushing over to these teams. So Cran has an opportunity to take the car, push up as... Cran Carry is going to try to grab his Chocobo. Let's ride. He's going to rotate over towards those bodies that he saw over here. He takes another snipe. Hits two. Hits three. Gets it down that time. Very good sniper shots. Here goes. Let's ride. Let's heal. See him heal up as the other teammate is pushing. Now he's getting shot at from behind now. He's going to keep rotating around as best he can. Puts down a fireball. Doesn't quite hit. Hits two sniper shots with the hip fire right point blank. Very good shots again. Good movement. Let's ride. Oh, we see a motorcycle push up on Cran as he tries to take a few hip fires. Throws down the fireball. Doesn't quite hit. He's going to run around this rock as the motorcycle gets off. Throw down the thunder. It was a sorcerer fireball coming in. He's going to play around this wall as much as he can. Cran, go ahead and, and hop on the motorcycle, but he takes a few shots as he's trying to back up through the lightning. Go ahead and throws his own fireball back at him. He's going to go ahead and take some shots as he made the distance there. He's going to take a little bit of Blizzard, which is going to slow him because I don't believe he has a jewel pendant yet. Some more shots put out as the Blizzard is going to come down. He is... Trying to keep his distance as this sorcerer is pushing up to him. Trying to hit him with the fireballs and the, the lightning. Cran is trying to keep his distance as much as he can. Puts down a fireball right on him. He's going to follow it up with some hip fires. One, two, three. Takes him down. That was a pretty good fight there. As Cran salutes and finishes him off. That is eight kills for Cran now as he's moving up into the next circle. He's going to ninja shoot up forward as he's going to position up into the circle here. There is four teams left with five people. He's going to move on his own. So we're moving into the final circle here. That was a very good thunder that we saw down right as the ninja. He gets one snipe off there. Right as his blade shift, that thunder, that was very good. I think he's down on health potions here too, so he's going to have to use his cure very Precisely, but he's out of MP too, so this could get very spicy very quick. That's something about playing solo versus squads is you're gonna take a lot of damage, so you have to get a lot of potions or cure. Because you're gonna have to quickly regen that health before the next fight. And we've seen it happen multiple times this game or this tournament where low health has been an issue and they've had to back up and find health spots as Cran goes down. Very good shots from whoever that was down on the ground taking Cran out. Let's go ahead and hop into the chat with them and, and break down this final, uh, or this match here. Let's go ahead and hit exit on this. We're going to hop in with Cran. Can you hear me? Yo. All right, congratulations on moving it into a game number three. I got a little spicy there at the end. It did, yeah. Some interest. I, I was low on pots, but yeah, it was uh, a lot of stuff going on there. Yeah, I, I was I was mentioning it how it it seems like it's very vital in squads and so or solos into squads to make sure you either have a leveled up cure or to make sure you're constantly finding those health potions. Yeah, definitely. Having high health pots late game is huge. Um, X pots even better. Um, but yeah, I mean, I, I unfortunately just got caught in a position where I didn't have a lot of MP, so I wasn't able to heal with cure even when I, even though I did have it. It was only level one, but I just I couldn't pop it enough to even get me going back to full health to be able to take a fight. So 
Um, just unfortunate, but yeah, I'm glad to be going to game three. All right, congratulations for pushing that to game three. We are going to take one more break as we finish up and set up for that final game. Let's get that hype going. Game three, 1-1. One, one. Winner takes all the next one. I am very excited.